CyberShield 2019 brought together almost 800 cyber defenders, mission partners, and trainers in an exercise designed to test the ability of the National Guard's defensive cyberspace operations elements. Key components of the National Defense Strategy, it talks about critical infrastructure and it also talks about just uh, being able to survive and succeed in a contested environment. That, that's what the exercise is all about. The exercise took place on a DOD certified cyber range configured to create a realistic network environment for the teams to operate. We first get together and think what, what are the training objectives for the blue team? And when we find those training objectives, we work from there to figure out what we need to do to put the teams in a position where we can measure them against those training objectives. And when we get those events, then we determine what infrastructure we need to have on the range. And then we think about what would an enterprise range look like? What is something that would have some realism for them? The exercise leveraged its civilian partnerships to create a realistic scenario. Um, network owners are the um, industry and, and our interagencies that come to the exercise to play a role for us in the scenario. So they are essentially, um, they own the network that's been compromised. The people that the industry is sending to us for the exercise, they have just really engaged in, in taking this exercise to another level in terms of their involvement. The opposing forces coordinated closely with the range evaluators to maximize the training value of the exercise. We had a very organized and focused uh, red team engagement and, uh, and everybody came together. Even though they didn't know in, anybody when they started, by the middle of this exercise, uh, everybody was working as one cohesive unit to deliver proper training for that blue team uh, on the other side of the keyboard. And the local range staff worked hard to keep it all connected. So uh, locally here in Indiana we have uh, something like 160 different switches all interconnected, uh, 300 plus laptops. I don't know, I would say miles of cable ran all over the place to get everything pushed up to Maryland where the servers are located. And what's unique about CyberShield is that it actually has a, a separate training week. So they yeah, do training the week before we do execution. Right. And that allows them to immediately apply what they've learned in their training into an environment that's similar to what it's going to be when they go on mission. So it's more of a train like you fight kind of thing. I'm Army Staff Sergeant George Davis reporting from CyberShield 2019.